We are in Colombo today uh, uh, to hold a joint aviation day in Sri Lanka together with the Civil Aviation Authority of Sri Lanka. So we have invited all the stakeholders here in Sri Lanka. There are at least 230 uh, participants based on the uh, records that we have. I think as the industry starts to recover from the COVID uh, pandemic, uh, there's a need for us to collaborate together with the stakeholders, airline, airport, uh, regulators, the government, uh, agents and so on, uh, to build back better. Sri Lanka is going to be back on the pre-pandemic level only on the 2025. So we have to do a lot of things in order for us to work with the government to make sure that we are on the right track to help and to make sure that the industry is back to the, to the normal condition. Then. The Sri Lanka Aviation Day, which we're having for the first time, is quite significant because it's to rebuild our skies after COVID-19. Through the pandemic, there was a lot of uh, is issues that were created for our industries globally as well as locally. Then we also had some other issues, domestic issues, which prevented our industry from growing. Today marks a significant day where we are able to keep a step forward, where we take our aviation industry, we bring all the stakeholders together and try to position ourselves in a particular direction. I think it's been a very successful uh, event. Everybody had uh, participated actively. Uh, we are very fortunate that the uh, Honourable Minister uh, joined us uh, for the event uh, and articulated uh, quite clearly uh, how he wants to take the uh, civil aviation industry into the future. Some good ideas from the participants uh, and I think the teams have worked really, really hard uh, to make this a successful event. I'm really content, I'm content rather, content with the day's proceedings. It was a challenge to get everyone together and handle the crowds and uh, work with IATA. Uh, there were a lot of demands from the panelists, the moderators, but we managed to navigate the, a very successful day and I'm really content that we have been able to provide very useful and truthful content for our stakeholders and the aviation community at large. Everybody agreed that uh, as we plot the pathway to the future, everyone needs to collaborate, to work together and to rebuild so that uh, the future of aviation in Sri Lanka will be promising and bright and there will be a new generation of uh, aviation workers will come into this market uh, and will contribute towards the success.